hi guys so I'm here today to do a requested look and the look for today is actually a soft green and yellow um, eye so that is what this looks like mm-hmm so yes if you like this look just keep on watching oh and thank you for requesting this look um, I kind of lost who it was who requested this like in all the comments um, and if it was a message it's been lost in the messages because there's so many messages in there I'm so sorry I should have wrote that down I'm gonna start and in getting into the habit of writing down my requests all right so um oh yeah and I wanted to show you guys my nails look how pretty yeah I did it myself and I haven't done my own nails in a while and this is actually the first time I do glitter acrylic so my lines are a little thick but besides that I actually love it you see it has like a little gift right there and then I have the spiral nail Woo! look at that how awesome I know not everyone likes this but I love it. See that? Check it out. Ooh. I know. Alright, so, anyways, go ahead. If you like this look, just keep on watching. Okay, guys. So, let's go ahead and get started. Um, I'm first going to be um, starting off with this side of the 120 palette. This is actually the only side of the 120 palette that, I, that I'm going to be using today. And um, the first one that, the first color that um, we will be using is, um, I can't believe I just forgot. Okay, it's, um, this fourth yellow right here. Okay, and I'm going to be using, oops, I you grabbed the wrong color. I'm actually going to be using the e.l.f. eyeshadow brush. And you can actually find this like um, at a Dollar Tree most likely. I actually bought it on elf.com or eyes um, eyeslipsface.com but I just recently saw it at my local Dollar Tree anyways so getting started I'm just patting that color onto um, the outer corner of my eye and just like that give you one second sorry okay sorry about that alright so yeah just pat that onto the outer corner of my eye and um, since this is more of a soft look and yellow and green can be very bold um, and very bright uh, I'm gonna go ahead and grab um, from the vanity wet and wild palette I'm gonna be using um, this brown from the matte side and I'm gonna be go I'm gonna be going in and applying that into my inner lid. It's kind of a half and half kind of thing. And then I'm just gonna pack over both of the colors right in the middle, just to kind of make them um, blend together. Okay. And now that we have that, um, we're gonna go ahead and grab our blending brush, and I'm using the Elf blending brush. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and from right underneath the marvelized colors I'm gonna be using the third one down this one right here and I'm gonna go ahead and pick that up with my blending brush and I'm gonna tap off the excess a little bit and then I'm gonna go in and put that on my crease All right, just like that. Matte colors are always like a little harder to blend, so that's why it's taking a little long. Okay, so once you have that, you can go in and um. You can go ahead and grab, well, I'm actually using the shadow brush once again, and the color right underneath the marbleized color, and it's that dark green color. 
and I'm gonna pick that up with my shadow brush and I'm gonna put that on the outer outer crease the end the corner of my crease like that I'm actually gonna go ahead and pick up a little more of that and put it on there we're gonna blend it out so it's not gonna be that big of a deal if it looks a little dark okay now I'm gonna go ahead and with my blending brush I'm gonna go ahead and blend that just a little into um, that softer lighter green and then I'm just making sure that they match and they do so I'm gonna go ahead and apply my um yeah I was gonna say my liner mascara no that's not it oh I'm sorry all right so I'm gonna go ahead and put my highlighter on which is this color right here from the vanity wet and wild palette and I'm gonna be using a highlighter brush with that you don't necessarily have to use a highlighter brush um, I'm just trying to be a little more precise so just like that and I'm kind of gonna blend it out with that too okay and there you have that Ooh, there we go alright so I'm gonna go ahead curl my lashes apply mascara and um, apply my liner oh wrong side and then I'm gonna wing it out just a little tiny bit I'm not gonna do mas um, mascara liner to my bottom lashes because I want to keep it um, soft but um, one thing that I forgot to mention was um, I put a little bit of yellow underneath my lid. And the yellow that I'm going to be using is the same yellow that we use for our outer corner. Alright, and then I'm going to be grabbing that dark green and applying that. underneath um, my waterline okay so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and I will be right back hi guys so I'm back and I have lined my lid um, applied mascara and curl my lashes I actually winged it out a little further than um, what I said um, to do it because I actually always like to have mine winged out a little further but um, to keep it soft you can go ahead and wing it out just a little or maybe not even wing it out at all so uh, that is what it looks like okay and um, I've applied my Plumberry Glow CoverGirl blush and for my lips I'm gonna be using my um, Nika K or NK um, glorious pink um, lipstick and that looks like that and um, gonna glide that off just like, um, and then I'm gonna top that off with my um, elf um, with my elf uh, pink kiss lip gloss and I'm actually gonna use um, a lip brush for this so this like a little tube thing and I'm just gonna pop it out and scoop it up with my brush okay and like that you get more of an even coat this way um, these tubes like tend to kind of put your gloss everywhere all right so I mean I'm not talking about the elf gloss I'm just talking about tube glosses in general um, all right so that is that and I hope that you guys enjoyed it and um, Thank you for requesting this look. I had lots of fun doing it. And um, so, yeah, that's all. Thank you for watching. And if you haven't subscribed, you know what to do. It's right up here. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye-bye.